In this video, I'm going to be walking you through how to scan documents into the document server and also how to print from the document server on a RICO MFP. The document server is essentially a hard drive at the MFP that allows you to store documents. So if your office has a lot of fillable documents laying around, this can be a great tool to utilize. For example, if you have multiple fax cover sheets laying around, you can instead save that document to the copier and retrieve it at will. The first step is to select our document server icon. From here we want to create a new folder. So there's an icon to the right that says new folder. Now we're going to name our folder, so select folder name, and then your keypad's going to come up. In this example, we're just going to name this our test folder. Now that we've created this, just select OK to save the changes. You can also password protect any folders that you create. Now that we have our folder created, the next step is to scan in the document that we want to have saved. To do this, on the bottom left, we want to select To Scanning Screen. From here, this is going to give us all of our options that we're used to seeing whenever we scan. So to the left, we can select Full Color, Black and White, Auto Color. On the top, we can choose the size of our original document. And in the middle, we can select if we want one or two sided. The two main things we want to focus on when scanning in a document is which folder we'd like to save it to and the file name. Select Target Folder to Store, and here we're going to select our test folder that we created. Select OK, and now we're going to name this file. So select File Name, your keypad's going to come up. I'm going to call this Mitch Card because I'm going to be saving my business card into the document server. Now that I've saved this to my folder and I've changed my file name, make sure that your sheet is in the document server and simply press start. Now my business card is saved onto the document server or the hard drive of the RICO and I no longer need an original to print out a copy. To retrieve any documents you have saved on the hard drive, simply select the folder and the file name of the document that you would like to print. You can select the quantity to the right and press start. Or to the bottom right, you can select to printing screen, and this is going to give you all of your printing options. You can leave this set to auto paper select, or you can choose the tray you want to pull from to make it larger or smaller. Also, you can choose if you'd like your final copy to be two sided or one sided. And also, if you have a finisher, you can choose if you want your job to be stapled. To show what this process looks like, note that I do not have any originals in my document feeder. I'm going to press start for the job that I have saved on the document server and it's going to print out my job. Here you can see it's now printing out my original without ever needing one in the document feeder. Now you are ready to utilize the document server on your new Rico MFP.